Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is the 13th day of the July Lico Daily Challenge. Hit the like button, hit the follow button, hit the subscribe button, hit the whatever button, uh, and join me in Discord. Let's do today's farm. Same tree. Given two binary trees, write a function to check whether they're the same or not. Two binary trees are the same if they're structurally the same and the nodes have the same value. Okay. So I think this is straightforward. Uh, it's a depth first search, but it is a fun depth first search in that you you could just move uh, You could do in order pre-order post order. It doesn't really matter as long as you move both nodes at the same time and making sure that they both propagate the same thing and The thing to notice is that they're the same if the pre-order is the same or if the post order is the same and if the structure is the same or something like that So you could do it with one depth first search uh, as long as you pass them together. So that's kind of let's get started uh, I think that's pretty much how I'm going to describe it mm, Let's see Let's go left I don't even know left tree right tree it doesn't really matter right um, And then now if left is none is not you go to right is none that means if one of them is none but not the other then we return false uh otherwise <coughs> if left is none or right is none and we turn true wait um Yeah, if one of them is none, but not the other, because if they're equal, then if they're both true or not, then this would have returned false. So actually, this already does this. I'm just writing duplicate things. <coughs> um. Yeah. Oh, so now if left is, that's why if left is none. Uh, or right is none. That means that if one of these is none, I mean this is actually kind of extra, but just to be for symmetry reasons, this is true because that means that the other one is also none, and then that means that they're the same, uh, and you can go further. But then now let's check if left dot row is not you go to right dot row return false because that means that they're not the same. Otherwise, we return go. Of left, oh sorry, left dot left. Okay, maybe my naming has been terrible. Actually, uh, let's let's go back. Let's go call these A and B, which is slightly better. Maybe not. So now we go A dot left, uh, B dot left, and go of A dot right, B dot right, and that's pretty much it. Um, yeah, and this is a depth first search. It just makes sure that every, every step or the notes are the same, and then we go to the left and the right recursively. Uh, I think the tricky one about this one is that there may be edge cases, so let's take a quick look. And now we have to copy the test cases uh, real quick. Oh, so I do have a mistake here, which is that, <clears throat> which is that for this one, I'm getting the wrong answer. Why is that? Hmm. This should be, this should be forced for one of these, right? Because A dot left and B dot left is not the same. Because this is not true, right? Or maybe... Maybe I just need some parents. I think maybe that's it actually. Uh, I hope so. Okay, yeah, so that was it. Uh, my logic is okay, but let me just add one here for also symmetry reasons. But it's just that, um, yeah, uh, that's why we use parents is to clarify the order of operations. And that was probably why it was because it was comparing this thing to B and then checking that whether that is none, uh, which is not what we want. But yeah, all right, let's submit it. Cool. 
Uh, seems pretty easy. Good practice for recursion. Um, yeah, so what is the time complexity? Well, it's just going to be linear because we look at each node at most once, both on the P and the Qs, uh, and you should mine it. No, I'm just kidding. Um, the, t the space complexity will be O of H, where H is the height of the tree, because that's the recursion depth, and that's how far you get in the recursion. Uh, in the worst case, it's going to be O of N because of you know the linkless situation where you, you can only go right or something like that. Um, yeah. Uh, that's what I have for this problem. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you have any questions. Let me know uh, if you have any love. And I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye-bye.